There it is, and stretch. Good. So, huh? And I'm a, no, we'll do that at the end. Okay. At the end, yeah. Right. So, just tell everybody like what kind of pain you're having. What's going on? So, a little bit of lower back pain. Uh huh. Um, uh, because you know I lift a lot. So. Yeah. Um, and a little bit. Do of you really? I don't know. <laughs> That's all I'm going Good, good, good. So you lift a lot. Low back pain. Low back pain. Um, okay. Just you know. I neck like tightness. Like neck tightness. Stuff. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. All right, so. We're gonna have to work on that. So the other thing we want to work on about, you can see from the side. No, no don't push it. Just wherever you stand normally, so I can show before and after. So about one fist away from the wall. I do want him to be more like there, so that makes sure he doesn't get that hump right there. So what we're gonna do is step forward right here. Okay, already. Um, get him from the front here. A um, little bit drop right there. No, you can put your arm down. Um, that one inch drop. We're gonna fix that situation right there. Gonna tilt right here. Now this is his like third, fourth business, so we're gonna get him right off the top. We're gonna tilt it this way, drop him this way, and pop. Good. Yeah. Okay. One more, one <laughs> more. All right. We're gonna drop him this way. Look up ceiling. Drop. There it is. Woo! That was good. Let's yeah. go. Stomach facing down. Uh huh. Breathe in. Breathe out. One. <laughs> two. Three, four, five. Okay. Yeah. There it is. Good. Uh huh. One more drop. There it is. Good. Bend this knee. Knee is tight. You can see one fist away from the wall, uh, from the glute there. So we want that to be a little higher, and that's stuck right there. We're gonna go one at the hip, two, three. Let's see if the knee is better. Boom, just one finger away, that's so much better. And way higher right here, if we increase his hip mobility right there. This one is stuck, one fist away again from the glute, that's a knee problem again we have to fix. And that's a hip right there. And as we get his orthotics in there, that should fix that. One, two, three, bend this knee one finger away. So this is a process we work on. There you go. Perfect. Done. Now, face me on this side. Bend this knee. Straight, straight this one out. Good. Good. Alright, now, drop your head down. Good. One more time. There. Ooh. I felt that one. Yeah, that was a big one. Turn this way. Okay, bend this one up. Knee straight, knee up. I'm gonna hold on to that right there. Relax, sorry. Good, one more relax. Good, let's go on your back. Good, slide down a little bit. There we go. Good. Damn, I get that again. Dude, that was <laughs> stuck in there. <laughs> you didn't even know that was in there. Look to the left. There it is. Good. Now we're going to get the rib cage. Bring your head up. One more time. Breathe. Breathe out. Two. One more. Good. Woo. Stay put. That was massive. Feels like he's working out right now. <laughs> Alright, you bring sweat here. Yeah, for real. You're sweating right. Everybody does. A lot of stress in your spine causes a lot of sweating. Pop that. This one knee and hip. Gonna come back up. Relax it. There it is. Okay, give me your hand. Come on up. Turn to that side. Put both hands behind your neck. Gonna open up. Look up. There it is. And stretch. Good. Down. Woo! Look at his neck now. Look. Turns like an owl. Okay, good. <laughs> Done. Come over here for me, already. Let's go back against the wall. Let's see if your head touches the wall closer. Boom. Just, just a little bit smidge, maybe, but it's mostly touching. Step forward. Bend that. Touch your toes. Boom. Nice. Good flexibility. Bend backwards. No, no. Step forward. Step forward. You're just gonna bend backwards. Good. Because a lot of bodybuilders don't have good, uh, um, basically. 
they can't they don't really stretch too much so a lot of them don't really have good flexibility but this one's really good he already is really good now he can touch his toe but a lot of times his spine was locked up so his muscles wasn't able to stretch now if you open up his spine then he's like oh i can turn my head i can move my shoulder i can touch my toes almost i can bring my head make sure it's touched well so he's not walking like this typical bodybuilder um, chest is overpowering the upper back muscles so we need to strengthen that one more than the chest and at least equalize it good. okay good what do you say to all the people that have in custody all the bodybuilders out there best doctor in the DA. <laughs> wow appreciate you man come through that was awesome good perfect done